Now, can somebody give me a signal of some sort? <laughs> We're ready to go, are we? R Arthur, no. Pardon? Hello. What, what's he saying in them things? Pardon? Yes. Yes, he will do, yes. Right. Start the clock. <laughs> I became the godfather to a baby boy, Angelo M. Lorenzi. What's the M for? It's a motorway in Great Britain between <laughs> London and Wales. I like to press out of. <laughs> the great little rich. So I'm gonna sue. Bill or George, but anything but sue. <laughs> Gentlemen, I like being here in England. <laughs> you know, I like watching the educational programs like Survival. When all them little animals go out into the wilderness. It is great. I watch it all the time on the television. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> you know, I like the villa beast and also the animal called the new. And the new have big ears and big horns, and every year they go out! <laughs> all over Africa! Where we should have won! <laughs> when we should have won! No hard feeling. George, that was great work. You destroyed 16 German tanks, 11 German armored cars, and 37 German planes. That's nothing. You should see me when there's a war on. <laughs> and the new went out in the big head, and they go out. <laughs> and then they mate in the woods. <laughs> I love that, I love that, I love that, I love that. <laughs> and then, six months later, the baby new is born, and the baby new, he goes, I love that, I love that, I love that. 
on your lady. Attack! <laughs> oh, I love China. <laughs> I'm Bert Lancaster. Get away. Aren't you the six million dollar man? Yes, but to you, five million. It's <laughs> mm, me now. And you shall surely win. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, grasshopper. Too <laughs> yeah. easy. Yeah. So welcome to another edition of Mastermind. <laughs> Will the best contestant please come in? Mr. Hulk, you have 30 seconds on general knowledge starting now. Arr. What is the 18th letter of the alphabet? In the, rural, in the rural district of the West Country, what word replaces the word for yes? Arr. Correct. <laughs> now sing the musical note E fifth. Examines the patient's throat. What does he ask the patient to say? Uh... Correct. Now, what is the abbreviation for the word Regina, as in Elizabeth Regina? Uh... Correct. <laughs> How hard is I started till I finished. How high is Mount Everest? 29,000. And 27 cents. <laughs> Sammy, Sammy. The correct answer is 29,028 feet. You're a foot short. I'm sorry, Mr. Pope. Hey. You are a foot short. A foot short. Walking in the rain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sonny Jim Blowder. Oh, I did join Mother Load and Father Load. Did join Cuddly Cuddly in the Arctic. Not so cuddly and see me, Sammy Jim Boy. But what in the matter with the hot and low down for them? <laughs> your mother, your mother, it and your mother it and I are very worried and deep in ah, the brain loaded yeah. oh, and think yeah. it and you. Because you are out at night and down at that down at that pub loaded and hot tops kiddly down the throcus. Oh, I want to drink it down the throcus and cross seconds of gut load and puke in the early morning. Oh. That's okay. <laughs> None of that. No, 
I realise your mother and I didn't. We realise you, the young man, and it's sap it and rising through the bootloaders and the knee clab it and throb it and the pulse open the veins hold it. It's not good. And then Nelly, the girl at Nelly called. Nelly? Nelly. You know the Nelly with the court judge. Nah, and I think it's always good this and all the thing broken for the old deep not joy. It's a deep joy. It's a deep folly boy. Deep folly boy. Now, you must not flog it and do that in court scene, Blasey. Oh, cobble loaders. <laughs> Hee-ho, come to the window. They always stare at me. Shake their heads in sorrow. Saying, who can that fool be? <laughs> Good old Mars. There's an evil hearted monkey who's the king. And he very often wonders as he looks up at the stars. Excuse me. Yeah? I've written a song about my girl. You've written a song about your girl? What is it called? I'm just wild about Harry. <laughs> and so that cry for water. Someone to slip poison into his spaghetti. Yeah, but who? How about Lucretia Borgia? Lucretia Borgia, she's dead. Yeah? Who got the control? <laughs> <laughs> Right this minute, 
this very second, a young man that goes by the name of Mr. Perry Como. <laughs> Catch a fun style and put it in your pocket Never let it fade away Catch a falling star and stick it in your pocket Save it for the rainy day Oh, let me come and tap you on the shoulder One star at night Then you feel you gotta hold it Got your falling start and put it in your pocket Never let it fade away Got your falling start in your pocket Save it up carry out executions at night and never during the day. Oh, so you really want to know, huh? You two-bit stinking punk. I'll tell you why. It's because it is cheaper. Cheaper? Yeah, cheaper. The electric chair's on the white meter. <laughs> Hudson! No, I don't, uh, I don't agree with you. What do you mean, I don't agree with me? Well, I just don't agree with you. Well, let's see it on the action replay. I haven't finished speaking yet. What? I mean, <laughs> it definitely was not a foul, and we can't see it on the action replay machine because it's broken. <coughs> well, you're always bragging how good you are. Wouldn't you do it yourself? Oh, I am good. Well, get on with it, then. You want me to do the action replay for That's you? That's what I said. Get on with the action replay. Right, OK. This is what happened by the penalty box. That's right. Where are you, man? Could you name a dark-leaved, evergreen, coniferous tree? You... 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 Correct. <laughs> but I still say it was a fool, the sir. Stood soup. The one in it, I've been it to me. I put him in my black boots to go and see on him. He ain't be a king of shield, but you and me are not a good one. He ain't 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 Well, you're talking awfully fully, no? I can't understand what you're saying. I can't understand what you're saying. Where yeah. you're from? You sound like Bill Shankly. I'm from Bangladesh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was talking to Derek Dugan this morning. Derek and he agreed Dugan. with me. And if he agrees with me, he said, you know what, Jack, yeah, I was definitely a pearl. That was quite good. Don't let Mikey Albert see you doing that. <laughs> um, well, well, you want to see the action replay? Well, you can only we... go over to Jimmy Hill. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's see an action replay in slow motion. Thank you.
together. You know the words. Uh, I say the time uh, on, of the clock on the old wall at a quarter to ten, and it's time to start fighting the flab. Oh, and if the state of your ginormous ties is driving you berserk, this is the exercise for you. Now, if you want to get a bit of fat of the of the old hips when the old fella comes home and he gets you in his arms and gives you a wonderful kiss. <laughs> well, yes. No, well, the exercise is this. You place your legs three feet apart. Don't forget, three feet apart. Oh, you've just been forgetting. <laughs> Don't forget to pull the blind down in case the neighbours are thinking you're doing something a little bit strange. <laughs> now, what can I do for you, Sha? Now, what can I do for you, Sha? Have you seen my umbrella? Oh, no, sir. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> you keep the left leg straight. Don't bend it upwards, inwards, at all, at all. Because cause there's no... There's... <laughs> Are you all right there? Fine. <laughs> Don't bend it at all, at all. Because, you see, you could keep your right hand out there. And if your right hand on heavy, you say, hello, sailor. <laughs> That was a lovely joke, it was. And it's the old... Oh, the, uh, yeah. uh, now, don't forget, don't be conglomerating yourself and hurting yourself, because uh, some of these exercises can be really complexing you and, and doing you some harm and putting this inside you don't want to pull them. Here, Captain. Why you got Enoch Powell following our ship in that third dinghy? In case we run out of wind. <laughs> Have a look down your ear, and I think it's down your ear, and, and then... <laughs> I, I think it's down... It's a little cold around the neck, so you better go and close the door so you don't get near them... <laughs> any of them drafts. <laughs> and the funny place is, well, you don't want drafts. You say, ladies... Friend. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is fighting the flab. And that was a scene from Paint Your Wogan. <laughs> I'll be glad when them builders are finished. <laughs> Hi, folks. This is my godson, Alfonso G. Torino. <laughs> Say, what's the G for? Can it, you? Bloody hell. <laughs> a duffel, a kick my gear. A duffel, a kick my gear. Kid up here. The props. Schmick says, guitar. Thank you. <laughs> I think I'll do um, some knife throwing. <laughs> I've always, I've always wanted to be a knife thrower. They're right good, they are. Get good. <laughs> Can you have some knives, please? <laughs> Bitchy boy, right, you, aren't you? <laughs> I'm sending you to Hong Kong, where you will steal the Maltese Falcon from its owner, Dr. Fu Manchu. Fu Manchu? But that sounds very dangerous. Think of my poor white hero mother. What about your mother? Why don't you send her? <laughs> There's a green and yellow planet to the north of good old Mars. There's an evil-hearted monkey who's the king. And he very often wonders as he looks up at the stars. Excuse me. Do you know what my favorite month is? No. 
know. What is your favorite month? April. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Bill. Cheers. <laughs> what song are we doing first? <laughs> right. <clears throat> this is a beautiful song, this, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you like this one as much as I do. This is the way the, the Americans do it, isn't it? All sophisticated. <laughs> okay, baby. <laughs> Feeling. Nothing more than feeling. I'm trying to forget my feelings of love. Tear. Trying to forget my feelings of love. <laughs> feeling. She just ignored me. She did? You miserable lover! <laughs> Have you ever heard a Frenchman sing like Sasha Distel? Now, all the girls go mad for him. They do. You know, they, because to a woman, a French accent sounds sexy and romantic. But if you really listen to a French accent, it sounds like they're being sick. <laughs> I'll show you. Le <clears throat> jour <laughs> Le jumeré, le jumeré, j'en goûte. Le jumeré, t'as dit, je crois. Le jumeré, le jumeré. Thank you very much, Hudson. You brought my whiskey. 
Uh, my name isn't Hudson, sir. It's Green. Green? Yes, sir. Green. Well, you must have a double. Thank you very much indeed, sir. <laughs> Thank you most sincerely. Now, uh, listen to me, Green. Another thing. <laughs> For an action replay. sending you on a very difficult mission. Yes. You are to go to Edinburgh and blow up every single pyramid. Hi. But, sir, there, there aren't no pyramids in Edinburgh. I told you it was difficult. Because I think your daughter's a fabulous young girl. I think she'll be on the back. Uh, how's about that one? Because you have now. Oh, yes. <laughs> Nelson. Oh, Nelson. <laughs> yes, I'd love to marry her daughter. I think she's fantastic. In fact, I think she's ooh, lovely. Lovely. I think she's beautiful. One of them birds that you see. Oh, one of them birds. I love them birds. The birds. The birds. I love her. I want her. I love her. I love her. I love that bird. I love her. I love that bird. <laughs> I want to marry a daughter. Don't you understand? I want, I want to marry a daughter. Yes, you, uh, you talked me into it. Yes. Well, guys and girls, how's it about that then? Because, you know, I went outside the other day and I tore, and I, I did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I saw two little sparrows sitting on a telegraph wire. And one turned to the other and said, hey, don't them long words make your bum tickle. <laughs> How's about that, then? <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And now... <laughs> no, no. Knock at the door once. Knock at the door twice. <laughs> and now, Mr. Chairman... <laughs> and I should say... Nothing in there. And nothing in there. as long as you're quiet about it. I'm going to give you a simple test we psychiatrists call association of ideas. How do you mean, handsome? Well, I'm going to say a word to you, mm. and I want you to answer me with the first word that comes into your head. Mm. Are you ready? Yes. Very well. Shoes. Men. <laughs> Table. Men. <laughs> Sky. Men. <laughs> Look, do you associate men with absolutely every word? Oh, no. Try, try me on spaghetti. <laughs> All right. Spaghetti. 
Italian men. <laughs> How are we doing? About ten miles to the Galon. <laughs> You've been blobbing to the cops. So what of a half? You're kidding. You know where squealers go, don't you? Sure. To Donny Osmond's concert. <laughs> <laughs> in Berlin this week, a prominent in German industrialist who had refused to pay protection money to local criminals was found dead <laughs> in mysterious circumstances. There were no marks on the body. Only a few phoenix. <laughs> Laugh! Laugh! <laughs> Get out! As you may have noticed, we have a guest in Panorama tonight. Captain Hans von Rotenheis of the Berlin Police. Tell me, Captain, does the increase in the crime rate worry the Berlin Police? Nine, nine, nine. <laughs> that was a joke, will you laugh? Now tell me, sir, what were you doing last night between the hours of eight o'clock and half past midnight? Playing tiddlywinks. Oh, <laughs> so that's your little game, is it? Honestly, uh, my wife told me she'd uh, lost a couple of my shirt collars at the, um, the, you know, the laundry. I said, you know, like I told her, I said, uh, I said, don't worry. They'll soon turn up, just like this one did. You there, Headman? Yes? I want you to carry out some immediate execution. I have just captured the Queen's lover, the Earl of Leicester. Earl's Court, King's Cross. <laughs> some Scottish poetry. This is good. <laughs> Hang on a minute, you. Who told you to start playing? Don't play till I tell you. I'll tell you, Jim. Don't start it till I tell you. Charming, manly, sweet and sexy. 
Why don't you sweep me up in your big strong arms and throw me across your horse and gallop furiously off with me into the sunset? And then, when we're alone together at your ranch house, I'll surrender completely to the madness of my wild, overwhelming desire. Why, you're playing hard to get. <laughs> Harlow, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> what do you think you're doing now? Let it happen again. The things that you say and do mm, makes me want to be with you. I know a rave on it's a crazy feeling, mm, and I know it's got me really damn so bad. You're the only rave on for me. Rave on, ooh, rave on, tell me, tell me, yeah. not to be lonely and so bad. You're relieving your love. Not to be lonely and so bad. <laughs> You're the only way on for me. What the hell happened to you? Road accident. Road accident? Yeah. Fell out of a black Mariah. <laughs> <laughs> Here, sir. Hudson, my smoking jacket. You want it, sir? <laughs> no, you fool. You can't fire. I say, excuse me. Yeah, what is it you want again? Could you tell me where the crow's nest is? <laughs> You'll not catch one, John, on that one again. Oh, no. <laughs> Which one again? <laughs> and that one where you go. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Honky Tonk. <laughs> Do you like my new bicycle? Mm, oh, oh, oh. It's 500 sissies. <laughs> I say, excuse me, could you tell me where the crow's nest is? Ah, no! Ah, no, 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 no! Ah, no! No, no, no! He won't catch me with that one! Never, never again! <laughs> First mate, tell me where it is then. Oh, hi. Where's the first mate? In the crow's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then, Mr. Cagney, where were you all between the hours of 8 30 and 11 o'clock last night? Committing murder, robbery, and kidnapping. Oh, now, come on, son. Don't come the old innocent with me. <laughs> I don't mind admitting it. After 11 days lost in the heart of the trackless African jungle without food of any kind, I'm feeling rather peckish. Of course you are, Pete. Of course you are. Right. My name. My name. Uh, I take it you're puzzled about something, Dad. 
Well, yes, Pete, you see, I see a gentleman in a low cut leopard skin swing, swinging towards us, you know, on a vine, you know, or am I crazy? Which of those two questions would you like me to answer first, Doug? I don't know. Oh, it must be the legendary Tarzan. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, legendary Tarzan. Hello, Dudley. <laughs> what have you got in there? Anything to solve our hunger problem? What have you got in that picnic hamper? Me bring you. What does that mean? Luncheon vouchers. <laughs> Dancer, satire. There's no use. The Jerry's have got us pinned down. We have to stay here, Sarge. Hey, what are we gonna do with this, this unexploded bomb? Oh, gosh. That's okay, Corporal. Okay? What do you mean? It's one of ours. <laughs> you know, last time I went back to the old country, I visited Venice, spent all my time sailing down the canals on a gordonzola. Uh, don't you mean gondola? Why do you care as long as it didn't leak? <laughs> Johnny Cash? Yeah? You brought me a guitar, and we'll send you the bill. Sue or George, anything but bill. <laughs> Hudson here, sir. Hey, man, and we this destroyer. Wows, wows, wows. Hey, boop, hey! Now the destroyer holds the destroyer. Hey, boop, hey, boop. There's an evil-hearted monkey who's the king. And he very often wonders as he looks up at the stars. favorite song? No, what is your favorite song? Gorilla, my dream. <laughs> Hi, folks. My name is Cliff Richards. I'm now <laughs> quite recently I've been doing exercises every day. In fact, I've been doing 50 press-ups with my top lip. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
favourite dish. But Johnny here dropped it last night while washing up. Hudson here, sir. Hudson, you may take a dinner break. Uh, thank you, sir. <laughs> Tell me, Bosun, what be compliment of the crew? That you're just gorgeous, Captain. <laughs> For heaven's sake, man, stop stammering! <laughs> My name is Fanny. <laughs> How would I like to make you a horse's doofer? <laughs> First, <laughs> seeing that this is the last of the series we've been making. I thought I'd bake them a little cake. <laughs> First, some water. <laughs> and if you like, you can put more water in and keep it going. <laughs> and then... <laughs> you break three eggs. self-raising.
much as we have. Thank you for being such a really wonderful audience. What do you want? What do you want? Pardon? Well, that's it, it's finished. <laughs> Finish! <laughs> wow, well, I'm going home. That's the end of the show. Sit <laughs> <laughs> all lads. Sit all lads. Sit all lads.